I'm going to show you how to go from a fixed hub to a selectable hub on uh, this Delica. So we have an aftermarket uh, hub. You can also get the OEM uh, Asian Izine, however you say it, uh, as well. These are a little bit cheaper and I think just as good. So to do this, we're going to need to take off this fixed flange, which is 15 millimeters. We're going to need to pop the grease cap off and then get off the keeper ring holding in the stub axle in there. So, I'll just get these out of the way. Okay, so there's our little circlip keeper. C rings off. That's our fixed hub. Nothing wrong with that, it works. And here's our selectable hub. So I'm gonna have to put the C ring on hold it and uh, get it to hold the end of the stub shaft here. And uh, so let me take this off. So I can go ahead and bolt that up. After. Take off all this. These are 10 millimeter. This would have been a great time to put some anti-seize on those, but I did not. shim back there behind the C-ring. Now the C-ring. Which can be a little tricky because you're trying to work way back in here. C-rings back in. So that's all fixed now. Put the spring back in. The big end goes towards the inside there. 
now I get the joy of getting this down. So it's got a gasket, paper gasket there. And basically, I need to get this to go down and get these splines to engage and then uh, get it bolted in place. Okay, so a little fiddly, but I uh, just had to get it lined up all nice to go in, and there we go. So, freewheel, so we won't turn the CV and the differential, and then lock. So, I don't know, leave it on lock in the winter, and summer just drive around free. Start your four wheeling weekend, just go to lock and leave it. But uh, it'll help reduce some wear and tear on the drivetrain and get a little bit better fuel economy not having. Um, all the wheel engaged to the CV going through the differential.